What's the chow chow chow? Slanton Joe here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Scorch Silver Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we got our fifth gym badge right here in Olivine City. We also took on a brand new area, uh, the forest, out here on Route 40. We this. There's a forest here, and we also went to the Safari Zone. And we got our encounter for the Safari Zone entrance as well. Today, we are heading onwards and upwards all the way to Seanwood City. Now, I'm guessing because they, put the, they moved the Safari Zone to here, they haven't put... So I just needed to take a drink. They haven't put the uh, routes out to the safari, so, you know, in Seanwood. So Seanwood is basically just going to be a middle, an island in the middle of nowhere. Oh yeah, spoilers. Core's on the team. So Core is my star you. Level 46, Illuminate the Ability, Surf, Psychic, Blizzard, and Power Gemma on its Musa. I'm excited to use this thing. I don't know why, but I'm, uh, but I'm interested. And it's never going to be useful as a star, you. So let's do... I bought a water stone, so I'm going to do this. It will never be useful as a star you. It will only be useful as a stormy. Cool, we have a stormy. And how? I'll even give you a PP up to boost your psychics by a few, a few levels, since I have one of those lying around. Don't think I have anything else that I need uh, to get rid of right now, but there you go. This is Route 40, so we do have a new encounter here when we run into something. We can definitely catch something. There also is the Whirl Islands. This trainer has just reminded me about the Whirl Islands. Oh look, you have a Stormy of your own. Seems like you also had this great idea that uh, should beat uh, Master Lee of the uh, Sea and Wood Gym. To have a Stormy on your team when you lose your Hypno. But I don't know if she's lost... She probably hasn't lost a Hypno like I did last episode to a, to a gym leader that really shouldn't have gave me too much trouble, really. But uh, that's just basically what how I roll these days. If someone gives me hassle, I'm going to lose Pokemon. I will steal this big pearl from these two trainers who decide to just stand there and not actually take the big pearl. My encounter for Route 40 is a tentacle. We haven't got one of these yet. I mean, I don't know how we haven't got a tentacle yet, but I'm guessing it's because we haven't ventured out into the waters. What do I do to this thing? Uh, I need to look at move sets and see if I can actually do anything to this. I mean, bite could work. He might live in ancient power, maybe. You would probably kill it. I mean, surf might work. Cut might work on Sweepy. You know what? I'm going to go into Sweepy and we're going to cut this thing.
Okay, I can live that. Right, cut him. Wow! That did so much damage from our least effective move. Uh, which... That's a Pokeball button. It's this button that's Pokeball. That's speed. That's Pokeball. There you go. By the way, I used an Xbox... Well, this is an Xbox One joypad. Before, I used an Xbox 360 joypad. I just... I like the Xbox joypads. It's... And how they're able to work with PCs really easily. It's different from the PlayStation and Switch controllers. I mean, I'd love one of those 8-bit Doe compute, uh, controllers. Those things are amazing. I used to have one that looked like a SNES joypad, but it broke. So I don't have that anymore. So I need to get a, I need to get a new one. I mean, obviously, this has to be named after the uh, whole uh, Pokemon Stadium thing. If you don't know, in Pokemon Stadium, there is a trainer who calls one of his tentacles a cool tent. So, we have to do it. This is still a tentacle, so we can run from that. And whilst we were running, I know a trainer decided to join us. Alright, fine. Uh, can I Venoshock you? I know Venoshock does more damage if I'm poisoned, if you're poisoned, but it did decent. And of course now you're going to have recovery, which is kind of annoying. Bite. Brings the rain. You know, I'm starting to see my green screen fade through my camera. Can I do anything about that? Filters. Um, hang on, I'm going to do a bit of live editing in the video. Yeah, 521... 522, maybe? I mean, there's still a little... 523. Let's go 523. Oh, wait. Now I'm washed out. Damn it. That looked good. Now I'm washed out. Now I've got to fix that, too. Again, live editing on camera, which shouldn't be a thing, but... Right, let me do that and turn the smoothness down. Yeah, that'll do. All right, cool. Sorry about the live editing on camera. Oh, a crawdont. I mean, I could cross this or that. Good work, Fat Bat. Yeah, sorry about the live editing on camera, but... Sometimes you got to deal with that. This is Route 41. I could get a new encounter here, but... I will probably end up end up getting a tentacle. So don't know. I can't lower my attack because I have inner focus. <laughs> I mean, I'm at that stage in the game where Dragon Rage is no longer scary. 
You know, like, there's an early game where Dragon Rage is scary, and that's why they invented Dragon Rage Claws. And Sonic Boom Claws, or as I call them, Set Damage Claws. Oh, Galissapod. I mean, I'm going to have to switch. Because I'm in a situation where I, I'm i either going to have to heal or switch. And I'll switch. I will choose to switch. Criminal coming out here, please. Uh, criminal Thunderbolt, please. Nice! Guzma's Galissapod is the only one that destroys me. No, no other Galissapods can destroy me. Ooh. Is Dive a thing in this game? I mean, Dive is a third gen move, so I could expect Dive to be in this game. See you in Wood City! I can fish here. Oh, I said I can fish here. Game, give me my fishing encounter. All right, so my encounter for Sea and Wood City is a Kavana. I mean, I don't think I can do damage to you. You're level 28. There you go. Second ball. Didn't need to. Nice. Cool. Carvana. I have no nicknames. For, I don't really have a nickname for a Carvana. It's not really a Pokemon I catch that often. Because it evolves into Sharpedo, so yeah, Jaws. Right, Route 41. I can fish on the uh, surf. My encounter for Route 41 is A. It's not that I have that. Come on, there must be other fishing encounters that this game has for me. Eight generations of Pokemon are supposed to be in this game. And all I can find is Magikarps and Tentacles. Eight generations of Pokemon. A more diverse Pokedex. These are all the things that were mentioned in the Poke Community notes for this game.
God damn it! I hate those uh, when it goes to two pages. A third attempt, and still only Magikarps! And tentacles. I'm gonna have to wait until later. I don't even know how I'm gonna get a better Pokemon on Route 41. I don't honestly know how I'm gonna get a better Pokemon on Route 41. Because there's nothing there. I tried. Hello. Well, you found my secret retreat. Please don't tell me when I live here. Uh, I'll make it up for you with this. HMO2, fly! Thank you. Are you Chuck's wife? And you've hid here? I mean, I could tell everyone that Chuck's wife still lives here on the island. I'm not going to. I'm going to be nice and not do that. But I could do that. Deep Sea Lab. Welcome to the Seenwood Deep Sea Lab. Feel free to explore, but don't bother the scientists too much. Hey, have you seen uh, have you seen any resurrected fossils before? They really seem to have uh, the process worked out well. Can you believe that 80% of the oceans remain unexplored? That's what drove me to work here. I want to uh, be one of those people who puts maps out the rest of our planet. It's the same here in the real world. Again, that's, that's not just Pokemon stats, that's real life stats. That's that basically say that over 80% of the world is just uh, of the oceans is still unexplored. Okay. Ooh, hello. What's that? You say you have a Pokemon fossil? I do. If you'd like, we can bring that fossil back to life for you. Would you like me to do that? Excellent. Ooh. And what... F um, what fossil would you be wanting to bring back? I can bring back all the fossils. Oh, that is going to... I'm going to have to do that off screen. Because that is a lot of fossils. The fact I can get all the fossils is a lot. And that means I'm going to have to do that off screen. Because... I can super speed that. What, are you, what am I doing, you may ask? I'm mimicking you, of course. It's pretty fun. Would you like me to teach your Pokemon to do it too? No. Oh, you're no fun. No, I'm not fun because I don't like mimic. Mimic is a bad move. Oh, we have an actual Pokemon Mart here, instead of the uh, Secret Mart. Karate. It, this Karate Dat. My husband really doesn't understand anything but fighting. I don't know why I married him. Uh, I mean, I can't help you there. My dad trains under Lee. He's obsessed with fighting-type Pokemon. I want to use the Psychic-type Pokemon. Tell my dad... Uh, tell me, uh, you do you have a uh, Hatony? I'll trade it to you for the Riolu. I do not have a Hatony. I would love to give you... I would love to get that Riolu from you. I love karate. A tough battle between two master martial artists creates the deep um, communication between two people. I hope to one day... A... Uh, my son grows up into a karate master. Um, no one tell him that his son is actually interested in psychic type Pokemon. Hey, Oliver. Oh, Joanne. I didn't expect to see you here. 
I, I was planning to explore the Whirl Islands, but unfortunately they aren't accessible right now because I don't have Whirlpool. Even though I'm the son of a professor, I still don't have Whirlpool. My college professor told me about the Whirl Islands uh, and the legendary Pokemon Lugia that is supposed to be rumoured to reside in them. By the way, did you check out the Deep Sea Lab in town? It's very fascinating. Yeah, they can give me all of the fossils. And it's really awesome, but we'll leave that there because I don't want to do that yet. Cherry Grove? Yes, it's a very long way from here. You know, uh, what? I, you should speak to the woman who lives in the lone house off town. That should be helpful. Well, yeah, she gives me fly, but I still need that badge. I can buy potions from here. I mean, I'm going to buy another 10 hyper potions. That should be enough to get me through this gym. All right, let's do it. We'll do the trainers now, and then we'll see where we get and uh, whether we can... Oh! Hi, Shane! What the hell? I can't believe I lost to a generic... Uh, to some generic ball cut karate chump. Oh, it's you. Hey! I'm sure beating you will cheer me up. I mean, I wasn't expecting a Shane battle, but I'll take a Shane battle. You have a croak. I mean, I don't have answers for a croak. I'm going to cross this with a croak, because I can't bring in Lantern. Foul place does a lot of damage. I can't bring in Lantern because, well, he's going to have Earthquake or Bulldoze or something that really, really, really deals with me. I mean, I'd love to stay in. Maybe I can. Maybe I can. Now I've Lemonaded, maybe I can. But it did give you the chance to set up a Reflect Wall. Which I don't like. Psycho cut? Can I live a psycho cut? I lived on 12 from a crit! Well, I knew I outspeeded the Malamar, so I could play the risky play. And I could switch out next turn if I just decide to take the hit. Air slash? Is that better? Or... It's... You are a physical attacker. So I'm not going to learn Air Slash. Shift Tree. I would love to stay in, but... It is not a good idea for me to stay in on this. Uh, what do I do here? Wheels? Okay, you knocked off, uh, you tried to knock off, that didn't really help you. I'm gonna heat slide. Heat crash. Your rocks hurt me, but they don't kill me. I think I can live another. Cool, I bring the heat. Right, what's next? Sharpedo Lantern. Criminal, get on out here, please. Your Aqua Jet does n Oh, I mean, it's a crit, but it did nothing. And that's your second crit of the match. What the hell? Wait, 
mean, I lived. I don't know how, but I lived. Again, I would love to stay in. I know I could beat a Houndoom, but this is and territory because, like, Criminal's almost dead. Wheels is almost dead. Flamethrower does so much damage! Oh, I mean... I don't know what to do here. Core? Because I can't live a flamethrower. Okay. Nice work, Core. Welcome to the team. This can't be happening. It very much is. I think I get it now. You're just like Dad. There's something both you and... Uh, both you and E have that I can't seem to grasp for myself. Fine, I'll just keep training. Soon I'll beat you and overthrow my dad and become the champion myself. Then maybe he'll... Forget it, I'm out of here. Is his entire arc basically he wants his dad to say I'm proud of you? Basically, that's his entire arc, isn't it? That's his storyline. That's why he's such an angsty teenager that basically wants to diminish me because I'm the favourite child of the family and he's the guy who, who never got to hear those words from his dad of, I'm proud of you, son. I mean, yeah, sure, that does hurt a child, I will admit, but still... Yo, how's it going, chap to be? I heard that the, the, sorry, the head of uh, the, this dojo is Seam Wood City's gym leader, Master Lee. Don't let his goofy haircut fool you. He's a fine type master Pokemon. He's a master Pokemon trainer. You have two options, psychic types, flying types, or fairy types. Well, I guess that's free, actually. Uh, good. Well, good luck for it. Go for it. All right. Hello, Mr. Lee. Who are you? A new student? Perfect timing. We will get warmed up. Now, line up. Attention. Yes, Sensei. Let's get uh, to work, starting with our striking drills. Now strike left. Oish. Strike right. Oish. Strike forward. Oish. You in the middle. What is your malfunction? What's that? You're just here to battle me? Ha. <laughs> I must say, I am not very impressed with you, uh, if you uh, from what I've seen so far. Tell you what. Battle all of my students. Uh, uh, constantly. Then I will give you a battle. Alright. I'm guessing I'm going to have to fight these guys all in a row with no chance of healing. In order to actually get a battle with uh, Master Lee. Thank you. 
Oh. I mean, that's a decent strat. I will give you that. Criminal, I will switch you. Don't worry. Breloom. I mean, I'm definitely going to switch you. Aha! You can't interfocus me! Uh, you can't intimidate me. I am in the focus. Bye bye, hit one top. And bye bye, Breloom. I mean, effect spore apparently happened, but also didn't happen. Yeah, I don't get a chance to heal. Alright. Ooh, Graplox. I hate Graplox. But I will take a crit. I'm hoping that I get a chance to heal. I don't know if I will, but we'll see. I also don't want to... We've already gone 32 minutes, so I probably... You're going to have sturdy... Nice try, you think that Retaliate's going to do things for you, but it's not. It probably will now. Oh, that's an Ice type. I mean, I could... I could stay in. Hey, we're a crit. I can stay in. And I'm a choke. Nothing beats Fat Bat. Nothing. You got nothing on Fat Bat. This is the fourth trainer? Okay, a hairy armor is something that might be the crowbat because indoor. Okay, you're naturally bulky anyway, so you would live that. How are you able to endure twice? Gallade. And that's a scary Pokemon, but I have Wing Attack. Which obliterates you. I don't need Quick Card. And a Farling.
you're really doing this double indoor thing again, aren't you? I don't know why he decided to do the double indoor strategy thinking it would work, but it, it doesn't. It doesn't work. Just give me a chance to go in here or in a Pokemon Center before I face you would be fantastic. A Medicham. Can be a scary Pokemon. I have we attack. Not a scary Pokemon was I have wing attack. <laughs> a good uh, again could be a scary Pokemon. I have wing attack. I'm going to use it. Oh, I mean, I can live a rock slide, right? A crit! Okay, Fat Bat's probably going to just rest now. Against a Polyrath, Fat Bat is... I haven't been able to heal, have I? I forgot Criminal's almost still dead. Thanks to Endeavor from a few fights back. Oh, you have water absorb. Okay, the only thing I can do to you is is psychic. <laughs> I should have been doing it. Lily Gellert. I mean, I gotta heal. It's the only way to beat a Lily Gellert is for me to heal. Pangoro. Don't live a crit. <laughs> so fetched. Okay, that could be annoying. I'm trying to save PP just in case I have to go right into this battle against this uh, gym leader. I hope I don't. There, I beat all your gym trainers. Wow, I was wrong about you. You blew away my... completely blew away my expectations. You have earned a battle. Go and heal, and I... And if you need to, I'll be waiting for you. Thank you for letting me heal. And also ending this episode. Because I was worried you were going to be like Whitney and say like, No, no, you're battling me now. Now, with your broken team... And now with my slightly fixed team, well, my actually fully fixed team, I'm ready to battle 
I'm ready to battle Master Lee in the next episode of our Pokemon Scorched Silver Let's Play. But until next time, I am Lantern Joe. Mean to the Pokemon get to that, sir. Everybody get Pokemon. Good night. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please consider leaving a like, comment and subscribing for more videos. And of course, if you ring the bell, you'll be notified first when those videos come out. You can follow me on Twitter at Lantern Joe, where you'll get news, thoughts and opinions from me and the rest of the Lantern Nation. And of course, if you want to watch some more videos, there should be something in the top right and top left hand corner of this here end card. But until next time, I have been Lantern Joe and... I'll see you on the next video.